And Coin 6 is your back to school headquarters. And before Beaverton students go back to class next week, a lot of families will have the chance to go shopping for free. The clothes closet serves more than 1,500 kids each year. Emily Burr shows you how this unique shopping experience works. Families who are coming here and the students that are being served really truly are in need. Volunteer coordinator Joanna Shrout says students in need can visit the clothes closet twice a year and take up to 10 items home. They can choose what it is that they want to take each time they come. All of the items are donated by the community and volunteers work weekly to sort and hang the donations. You know, we make sure that there's no holes, tears, stains, um, that they're age appropriate. We've got it organized by, by gender so that people come in and they have that shopping experience. Volunteers also work with students and their families to make sure they get what they need. Last school year there was a young girl came in and she obviously needed a bra and she was just kind of standing kind of hunched over and I kept asking her what size do you wear? She's like you're not going to have anything for me and she was so thrilled that we actually had a bra for her size. Sandy Axel is a regular volunteer at the clothes closet. We have all kinds of folks who walk in um, accessing the program and it's really neat. She says it's a rewarding experience and they're always looking for more volunteers. And just come and be ready to help others because that's what we're all about. We're about helping other folks. It's so important for kids at school to feel good about what they're wearing. And really this program is definitely something that feels good and it's just such a direct reward. Emily Burris, Coin 6 News. So the closed closet is open every Wednesday from 10 till 7. That starts tomorrow. Volunteers say you should expect a wait in the first few weeks. Yeah, they're probably busy. If you want to access the closet, you need to contact your school office or your counselor. For information on volunteering or donating, just go to coin.com and click on special reports in your back to school headquarters. You'll also find a printable sign for your first day of school photos and the first days for all of the districts in our area. Great program.